how we we catch all those who attack bees. Okay. Uh -huh. So all the bees will come inside. So There's the guard bees. We cut the bottle bottom yeah. here and yeah. we cover it with cloth. Okay. Again. So this is just so that they don't suffocate. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Is this the colony? No. Uh, no. Okay, we will get the colony from there. Okay. Yeah. And we we'll bring it here. We will bring it here, here and we will like split it. it. Ah, so the actual entrance they make this kind of tube. Yeah, yeah like tube. Okay. Well. So enemies cannot go inside with. I want to take it So then what? What we will do is just we'll you snap that off. Okay, like this. No bee can go out. Okay. 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 Okay, so you're using the propolis to kind of block up the entrance a yeah. bit. And the only way they can get out is into the bottle. Yeah. Then okay. what we'll do is we'll knock it. So the attacking so bees are now coming out. Yeah, okay, coming you can out. really see it. Wow. How long would you do that for? Well, maybe five minutes time. Okay. Yeah. That's also a very clever way to uh, <laughs> catch them. Uh, yeah, yeah. So they won't disturb us again. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so that, that one is full. Yeah, it's full. So you've just put on another one. Yeah. So now uh, what we have to do is we have to keep it in some shade, place. is it? Shade. Uh -huh. So we can keep it here. I get fuel cell oil as well. That is fine set. That looks amazing. So this is how it is. Okay. So in the middle there you have the brood? Yeah, this is the queen cell. So basically that one yeah, is that the one. queen cell. Yeah. It's like three times the size of the normal, normal worker one. cells. So again you, you can see some brown eggs. So you can see some brown eggs and uh -huh. white eggs here. So white eggs, brown eggs. Uh, there are two variety, uh, uh -huh. two kind. Uh -huh. This is very young. Okay. Okay. So when when they get uh, older, first stage. First stage. This is the first stage. Okay. This is the first stage. Maybe you zoom zoom it. You can see that there is small egg. Like, I can see the little larvae inside. Yeah, yeah. larvae inside. Uh -huh. When they get uh, older and older, yeah. they start uh, removing the outer skin. Uh, like wax. Wax. Ah, okay. So it will be like this. So the first stage is it, they, they yeah, turn they brown, then they, they take, take the wax like. out. Yeah. Yeah, and then they turn white, and then they're ready to hatch. Yeah, they will release. Okay. <laughs> yeah. And and this one is the is the pollen. That's the pollen store. Yeah, they store inside the propolis. Okay. So once you. You can see that some water inside uh -huh. the pollen. Yeah. They they bring water from outside. Yeah. They mix with uh, this pollen yeah. and give it to the the, the young the young, young babies. Okay. This is the honey part. Okay. Uh -huh. This all honey is stored inside the propolis. So the honey is actually stored inside the propolis, and yeah. here is another chamber full of honey. Honey. Okay. Okay. And here is uh, the pollen. Pollen. Pollen and water mix. Uh -huh. and water mix. Okay. Normally, even sometimes they collect water from honey. They strike it and keep it here. Uh -huh. Okay. To yeah. give to the infants. Yeah, to mix so, it with the pollen. So you can see that they are making some new, new layer. Mm -hmm. See here, see here, okay. and see here. So that means they are getting source of honey from other way. Yeah. So they are getting ready to fill it. So okay, so when it, they make a new kind of cavity, that's yeah. where they fill it then with yeah, honey. Then they fill it, then then close it. Okay. And again, they will fill it all the blank space. It will be full of. So all of this is already fill, filled up filled with honey. honey. Yeah. And sealed with or built with propolis. Propolis. As as their cells. Yes. Okay. Wow. And when you look at the Indian bees or Italian bees, yeah. it take around uh, 10 to 15 days to come out. But yeah. it it take uh, nearly 50 to. 60 days. So you're saying that this one queen cell would take nearly 60 days for her to emerge out yeah, of the. Out okay. Uh -huh. Wow, that's long. Okay. So, so what we have to do now is we have to 
either we have to find out the Q. Yeah. Which will be very difficult. Well, which will be very difficult. <laughs> but most probably we can see it somewhere. Mm. I mean, how much bigger is she than the small small oh, bees? Oh, very very big. How big? Like uh, triple triple than this bee. So three times the size of the small bees. And yeah. Yeah. So first of all, we can uh, remove the honey. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. We have enough honey here, so we don't disturb this honey. Okay. So you keep always about that much, yeah, that like much. a handful of honey. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So after that, we can split this one. Mm. Yeah. The main demerit of this box, yeah. when we take honey, we have to kill at least uh, uh, thousands of uh, newborn. Okay. So, for that case, it's safe. Uh, so I didn't understand that now. So, when you are when you are taking the brood to start a new hive, is it? No, no. When we collecting honey from this kind of yeah. uh, hives, yeah. we have to kill at least. Uh, uh, thousand of newborn uh, bees. Uh, is it because the newborn bees will be on on, uh, on inside, the, inside the, the honey? Uh, ah, okay, they're so they're, they're feeding off the honey. Yeah. So th so if you don't have this kind of hive, yeah. you're gonna kill a lot of newborn babies. Yeah. We are looking whether a queen is here or not. Okay, so you wouldn't want to kill the queen, of course. Yeah. 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 Uh. And is she very likely to be on the honey stores or would you mean no, no. more likely to be on the Once we knock the uh, box, yeah. she knows that there are someone to attack the box. So she wants to escape from attack. Oh. She, she, she wants to hide. Yeah. So you can look at here, see another queen cell lying down there. Where now? So, you look close, so there is another leg. You can see another leg. I can see one queen cell there. Yeah, uh, down, uh, just down there, another cell also. Ah, I can see there now, yeah, down yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. So, there and it? there. Yes, one second, let me just get in there. Hmm. Okay, so, there and there. One thing I want to mention is that yeah. uh, the other base. Yeah. If there is a Q, one queen and a new gyne, there is a, ch a chance to swarm. So when there is basically, if you leave a queen cell and a queen inside the box, yeah. of course they're going to swarm out as soon as the virgin, as soon as actually the, the queen cell is sealed, yeah. the old queen will go It'll with go the swarm. But now, in this case, yeah. it won't go out. Yeah. Either the two or three queen can uh, live together, but it will be gyne, without mated with a uh, male one. Okay, so there, there will be two reserve queens in there, yeah. but they will not have mated with the it's, it's drones. A, yeah. It, yeah. Suppose if they get another living place better, yeah. uh, the new one can go outside and mate with them, and they'll move to a new, new hive. Okay, so it can happen that they will swarm out, but mm. generally speaking, they will just stay in the hive. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so... And will they also sometimes, when the old queen dies, then they'll replace yeah, it replace with the new one. Okay, so there's no yeah. way you're ever going to lose a colony of bees yeah. because they're just going to just keep themselves going. Okay, so a stingless bee colony swarm. So a lot of these bees are actually just going back in here. So it looks like they're getting less and they probably have just finished swarming. Well, not quite, but they probably will do. So you don't have to actually literally do anything like um, you know, watching like every nine days for queen cells no, and all nothing, this kind nothing. of stuff. No, no, no. Okay. Once you find queen cell, you have to uh, crop it and yeah. uh, take it and put it in a new box. New box. Yeah. If you find queen, we can make it. Uh, we can divide it into three. Mm. So it's our tools size, <laughs> tools box. Okay. Okay. So you're putting it, the youngest, youngest into the box. Okay. Box. And we have to separate some. The elder, some of the older, older, yeah. Also. 
So we want the maximum reduced flow. So you're just very gently trying to separate them? Yeah. Okay. Without breaking legs. Yeah. As best as you can. Yeah. So, you can see the, the layer like other one. Yeah, <laughs> looks amazing. Yeah. yeah. So you take about that much yeah, that of much. the older ones yeah. and about yeah. that much of the younger ones. Okay. Uh, okay. So, we'll, we'll, I'm checking whether it's another queen cell here or not. So, we, get, we keep it here. You just place it like that? Yeah, later. That's it. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so you got the queen cell. Yeah, without any damage. Yeah. So we'll keep it here. Just place it anywhere on top. Yeah. Anywhere in top. Okay. That's the new queen. New queen and hey. So what you're looking for now is... I'm looking for the queen. Oh, the queen. If I'm able to find out the queen, we can split into three. Which would be really handy. Mm -hmm. You can see the newborns here. Mm -hmm. the, the white white one. Mm -hmm. I see them there. Yeah. So what you have to do next is, you have to collect some... Hold on. Okay. From next week onwards, we once this flower. So you're putting a bit of pollen in there as well, yeah? yeah. yeah. Which you put here at the back. Yeah, in the front, in the front. Oh, in the front. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. First pollen, second egg, egg then third uh, yeah. honey. Oh, that, that's uh, a combination. Okay, pollen, long eggs, type, long honey. Type, ah, or okay. this, this kind of box. Yeah. And what about the other? Sorry? What about this uh, This one here? What would you uh, do? Yeah. Anywhere you would place. Yeah. Only yeah. honey, small bit, put it on top. Ah, okay. So you're looking now for the queen just in yeah. here, or queen? Yeah, you've been very gentle there. Okay. Yeah. He's probably yeah. hiding in the corner there, probably. Yeah, yeah. No, no, no. Huh? I mean, at least that's what the Italian bees or European bees would do. So what we'll do is, we'll close it again like this. Yeah. Okay? Yeah, perfect. And because of the propolis, it kind of glues together a bit, yeah, huh? Yeah. One thing you were mentioning to me yesterday in the car is that basically they, they actually support each other. They, they, they actually they are, almost they work is, together. Yeah, they work together. Suppose mm. if the pollen is, uh, sorry, the pollen is short here, yeah. they will go, go to this colony, they will collect it back and... So they're almost treating it like one colony, yeah, which, which no, I don't know any other bee, yeah, European, they, they would never do that. You know, so that's amazing, yeah. Great. Okay, so then the last step is just to close it up. Yeah, oh, we'll press some your, your friend, yeah. your colleague is actually just smearing a bit of propolis around the edge, yeah. right? Yeah. Okay. So yeah, now we are going to close it. Mm -hmm. So our new box is ready. Maybe in next 10 days time, the new queen or something will come we'll out. Hatch. So anything between... Well, because they've taken the wax off the queen cell, mm -hmm. it means that she should hatch, because it takes about 50 days, right? Mm -hmm. it's, it's already 35 to 40 days now. Okay. That's why the egg is white. Well, okay, so a white so, egg is what you want. Yeah. Can so, you also use a brown egg? Yeah, definitely. Okay, so that's also possible. But the busy. brown egg, is, there is more chance to break when we crop it. Okay. okay. So yeah. for the white eggs, they are more stronger. So in that case, just take the, the eggs surrounding it yeah, with it. Yeah. But okay. for this case, the two eggs are very close. Mm -hmm. So it's very difficult to <laughs> crop it. Yeah, I saw that. Yeah, yeah that's true. Yeah. Otherwise, we'll crop with another egg. So you would just take uh, the whole part, thing whole and thing then you wouldn't damage the, the egg. So. Okay. So. So. so... The entrance is that place. Okay. So. So the entrances are all facing the same way? 
Is that correct? Yeah, or? same way. Okay. Uh, the initial box is in, in the center. Yeah. So we we keep uh, like a half feet distance. You mean a half fist, not half, half feet? Half feet. Half fist? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So, so yeah. Just, uh, yeah. So, just a little, uh, yeah, maybe about that far apart, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, okay. So, we, we can, uh, they lose the original entrance, they search for uh, where they <laughs> the entrance nest. Sorry, hard. So for, at the beginning you want to have them close together, right? Yeah, close to even one feet also no problem. Yeah. You can keep it in one feet distance also. Yeah. The but can I ask you, are you putting the original colony back in the same exact location? Or are you putting the okay. new colony in the same location or both? No, both will change ah. a little bit. Yeah, okay. Okay. Yeah. Both colony will change a little bit. So that they get a little bit confused. A little bit confused, then they'll start uh, someone going the old one, someone going the new one. one. So uh, almost it will get balanced. And because there's brood and everything in both of them, both of which them. smells the same, everything yeah. the same, they will go into both, and then yeah. they will start building out both. Yes. And they treat it almost like one. Yeah. And how far away could you bring one colony if you wanted to bring it to a new location? How so after, how far? After normally after 30 to 40 days, okay, we can shift this colony to another location. But, okay. but it should be uh, more than 500 meters away. So what's what's uh, what's your colleague doing there now? Just to uh, finish up the. She want to prevent uh, that from ants and and any other kind of insects. So yeah. She will pour some water into. Into in that terracotta pipe. Yeah. So that's actually like to prevent ants from getting and up yeah, there. Yeah. And she's also covered it with plastic to yeah. stop the rain. Huh? The rain. Okay. Okay. That's all. You can see that the bees are getting to new hives. Oh really? I can see that. Yeah. yeah. And the older one also. Yeah. And what your colleague is doing, those bees won't attack her now. Does she want the netting or anything? She want to. You see, she's open one. Okay. 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 Ah, oh, just places her on top. On top. So she'll move from that place right now. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, they might start attacking, huh? You look at the bee size, it's too small. It's a, this one is now the really, really small one, yeah. right? Yeah. So one of the seven varieties that's... Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Wow. Again. There see, she see, is. See, yeah. 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 I see her there. Yes, 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 Hang on. Yes. She's in there, no? She's gone down. She's hidden. She's hiding. There she is. There she is. Okay. Okay. Nice. Okay, okay. Okay. I think you can get it here. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yes. There's the queen. Yeah. The one that's running around trying to hide. <laughs> <laughs> so we got her on camera, that's great. Okay. There she is. Yeah, yes, yes. She is way bigger, huh? Yeah, it's very big. We'll get here. Mm -hmm. Okay. Again. Little more. Little, little honey. Mm -hmm. So that's po mostly pollen with a bit of honey? Yeah. So now, you can, you can close it. This yeah, one. there you go. Okay. Okay. We'll fetch some. So that's an attractant? Yeah, yeah for attracting bees. Yeah. Okay. This next step is to we'll take some honey from here and we'll keep it here. Okay. For their food. Yeah. So we broken, so we keep all the small. That's all it is. All it needs to actually attract them up into the super. Okay. Okay. 
Edwin, we are going to keep the both colonies at the same place. Uh -huh. So, and I am going to open the bees. So, it, it, it will split into two boxes equally. Okay, so that's you just took the split from. Yeah. And you put them in there. Yeah. And both colonies are going to be in the same place. Yeah. We are going to open. Yeah. And release. They were the attacking bees. Attacking bees. I never met you, Trito. They're starting to attack you. Attacking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Trito, now we want to move the place, otherwise they will attack you. Yeah, let's go. Let's go. That's great.